Hi, this is Ikrufei from Spectra Audio. In this video, we're going to take a look at the new deluxe pack available for CV2 Kit 2.0. So the deluxe pack includes 9 modules, the bias switcher, shift to register, Euclidean sequencer, logic, matrix sequencer, MIDI control, trigger burst, VC switch and VCA. The bias switcher module uses probability to activate one of its two channels. It's great for adding variations and randomness to your patches. You could, for example, route two different AD envelopes to the bias switcher and randomly switch between them. The shift register module uses an 8-bit shift register to create evolving sequences. The loop parameter lets you lock the generated sequences so they change less often, while the probability parameter affects how the shift register generates new values for the sequences. The Euclidean sequencer uses an Euclidean algorithm to create interesting trigger sequences. You can set the size of the sequence as well as how many hits you want per sequence. You can also use the shift parameter to move the hits around. The logic module uses Boolean logic operations to combine two incoming signals in many different ways. This module is useful for combining gate signals to create different variations. The matrix sequencer is a unique module that combines a 9x9 matrix, a Cartesian sequencer and a 4-bit tag. For each step, the module reads a 2x2 section of the grid and converts it to a proper voltage level. This means any change to the matrix will affect many steps at the same time. The matrix sequencer also features different sequencer modes, which you can use to create different sequences without having to change the matrix values. MIDI control lets you use the MIDI controller as a CV source. This module also includes a learn functionality that lets you easily map any sliders or knobs that you have available in your MIDI controller. The trigger burst module creates very fast trigger bursts that can be used to create interesting exponential rhythms. The different parameters available lets you change the speed and shape of these bursts. The VC switch is similar to the bias switcher module, except it uses incoming gate signals from the gate bus to switch between the two inputs. Finally, the VCA module lets you use an incoming signal to control the gain of another signal. It also features an exponential parameter that lets you change the curve of the VCA's response. If you'd like to know more about the Deluxe Pack or any of the other packs available for CV Toolkit, visit SpectroAudio.com. Thanks for watching.